Um, I'm back. Talked about the Fitbit. Um, this will just be quite short, but I just want to show you some of the stats. Um, as I said on one of my videos, I sort of punished myself for being a bit lax, which was that day and actually the day after. Um, I basically did 20,456 steps that day. Um, I mean, I can't always do the steps, that's the funny thing. Uh, but I, I try to get over eight and a half, absolute minimum. Uh, this is short today because obviously this, this is my morning walk. Um, but the thing is, it's actually increasing. I'll, I'll show you why in a second, why this will make more sense. Because this is purely steps. Uh, now, you can get other people roped into this as well. You can add them onto your, um, you know, get them to sign up. You can actually monitor where you are ranking-wise. Uh, as you can see, my sleep patterns are actually improved lately. Uh, today's stats, I've done 42% 40, of my steps, uh, burned... 55% of my calories, 49% uh, of the mileage covered, because uh, 10,000 is roughly five miles. Uh, so it's, I should be doing basically five miles a day, uh, which is which is uh, what you should be doing anyway, uh, which isn't always possible, especially when you don't actually recognize your, your distances that you're doing. Um, this is basically how much active uh, time you've had which is 37 active minutes so far so I'm doing over an hour a day active minutes and this is the number of steps I'm going up it's added this on I haven't added this it's, it's decided I'm now doing steps because I go up and down um, going to the roof and things but this is the bit that's important um, as you can see here um, where's the steps it doesn't actually have the steps on this bit but what's happening is, as you can see, I did 23 minutes and I burned 200 calories. As my average heart rate's 100, but I'm actually increasing this and I'm increasing the distance. So what's actually happening is my heart rate's going up, which means my calorie burn rate's going up, which which also sort of ties my minutes down. So what do I mean? Well. If I do, like, say, 6,000 steps, and originally it was taking 30 minutes, if I do the same distance, I'll be doing it in 25 minutes. I'm increasing the speed because it increases my burn rate, but I'm still covering the same distance um, because it's, in, it's pushing the calorie burn up. At the same time, it's reduced the amount of time I'm doing it on a daily basis. My fitness is actually improving. Um, I also do this as well which is the 250 steps a day. So though I get these walks in, which are 30 odd minutes a time, um, I still do 250 steps every hour as well. This is why it sort of always ends up totaling at least uh, eight and a half upwards. Um, but I do try and average over the week um, 12 and a half thousand steps. As you can see, I'm slightly under that at the moment. But then again, I've only done half a day today. And I had a bad day last week. I can't remember why. I think we were out and about doing something, which is why it was a bit lower. Um, but most days you'll find that I'm doing at least eight and a half. If I get something that's low in the early weeks, please bear in mind I was on a plane at the time. <laughs> um, but it's getting there, and that's what I like about this. And you can put your what you're eating you can scan barcodes with your smartphone it'll put all the calories in there so you know how many calories you've intaken and then it tells you how much you burned and how much you're eating so you know if you've eaten too much or or burning too much you know in the sense that your your weight's actually coming down um so it's all good it's all really really good um myself i've stuck to this as you can see every day i've got a relatively active window um and this i'm trying to remember it is this the week i come over because if it was that's probably why it's, this one's a bit lower because the week before that would probably be higher but anyway that's it you know thanks for watching but i just want to share that because i just want to show you the sort of stuff you can get out of this um there's also groups as well so you can join a community group in your area um that are involved in Fitbit and compete against each other, support each other, etc. But yeah, I'm loving the Fitbit. Thanks for watching.